Twelve popular celebrities who never expected visited TV Joshua for Miracle. Number four and eight will surprise you. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. To get notified when we post our juicy news updates, please click on the notification bell. The passing of Nigerian clergyman T.B. Joshua is a significant global loss, considering its wide-ranging visitors from various backgrounds and countries. Here, we explore a handful of well-known individuals from around the world who have visited him. Number one, Jamaica. One such visitor was Jamaica, a well-known Nigerian actor. Video of his alleged deliverance from a mysterious illness spread like wildfire across the internet, drawing attention to the power of T.B. Joshua's ministry. The actor's transformation captivated the world. Two, Prof. John Evans Atta Mills. Another remarkable encounter was with Ghana's former president, Prof. John Evans Atta Mills, after his election victory. He attended the SCOAN, SCOAN, for a Thanksgiving service. He later revealed that Prophet T.B. Joshua had accurately predicted his triumph. The cleric's influence even extended to Ghanaian politics, where he allegedly organized prayer to intercede for the nation. Richard Kingston Richard Kinson, a veteran Ghanaian goalkeeper, was another devout member of the SCOAN, Synagogue Church of All Nations. He frequently visited the church, testifying to the assistance he received during the 2008 World Cup. Kinson's loyalty to the Prophet was widely acknowledged. Angel, Gom Angel Gomez From the realm of sports, young English soccer star, Angel Gomez sought deliverance from his injuries. In a heartfelt testimony, he expressed his struggles with recurring hip and groin injuries. Hip and groin injuries which affected his career. Through the prophet's touch, Gomez believed his athletic potential would be restored. Kwabla Sinanu Kwabla Sinanu is a Ghanaian human rights lawyer and he proclaimed that he was delivered from a spiritual problem. Denise Williams. Not limited to actors and athletes, the church welcomed Denise Williams, a Ghanaian musician. She revealed how she had been delivered from a demon that was plagued her with drug addiction and societal thoughts. The power of TB Joshua's intervention changed her life forever. Camila Mberekwe. Camila Mberekwe is a respected Nigerian actress was also counted among those delivered as the SCON, the Synagogue Church of All Nations. Her story of liberation from her sin forces added to the mystique surrounding the Prophet's ministry. Mercy Cherano. The list expanded to include Kenyan Olympic athlete Mercy Cherano, whose marriage and career has suffered due to an evil spirit. Her testimony spread like wildfire across Kenya inspiring many to seek solace in TB's Joshua's ministry. Monachi Abi, the most beautiful girl in Nigeria, Monachi Abi made a discreet visit to the synagogue church. Though the purpose of her visit remains a mystery, it only added to the allure surrounding the prophet's ability to draw celebrities seeking spiritual guardians. Hans Anuku, Hang Sanuku, a veteran actor, openly shared his experience of being healed from mental illness after encountering T.B. Joshua. His heartfelt account touched the hearts of many, shedding light on the transformative power of faith. Ogei Onazi and Joseph Yobo Ogei Onazi, a soccer star, and Joseph Yobo, the former captain of Nigeria's Super Eagles, were also accounted among T.B. Joshua's close associates. Their bond with the Prophet brought them solace and strength during challenging times. The tales of these 12 celebrities who sought miracles from T.B. Joshua are brought a glimpse into the vast impact he had on people's lives. 
from, at from actors to athletes, musicians to political leaders. His influence reverberated worldwide, leaving an indelible, indelible mark on the hearts of those who believed in this message of hope and healing. Now, this is sincere. A lot of things are coming out. And see, I don't know why I don't really care. It is because this particular man is not even, he's no longer here. People will just wake up, they drag this man name up and down. I don't understand. Sincerely, if these people have come out, you know, with us, okay. You know, even if you want to say, okay, you want to say they are saying the truth. It's okay, they want justice. You understand? Or it should be said that, ah, then define relevance. Or they just won't pull the one ministry down. But at least you will be, okay, if it's from the side of truth, if the investigations are going on, you will say, okay, oh, these people actually want justice. But now, what do they want? Now, in the midst of all the, you know, revelations going on, he did this, he did that, he did this, he did not do this, he did this one for me, he did this one, he made me go through this. And now, somebody writing this article here. <laughs> um, uh, not only God know, that is all I have to say. Eh? That day, <laughs> if everybody, I mean, it to get to everybody. Everybody will answer the call of nature. You know, I've already said that in life, it is only death that is certain. Every other thing you're doing is not certain. You know, such as the money where you push you, you go make up. No jokes apart. It is the, what is immediately someone, somebody is given birth to. Immediately a child is given birth to. The next thing you need the eh, I won't make my baby die. You. Death is already a certain thing. You understand? It's like if the first certain thing in life. So when we reach there, Eh? We go see, <laughs> we go see things for ourselves. That time, eh? We go do waiting. We go also know the truth because right now, uh -huh, I cannot come out and tell you that this is the truth. Though. Sincerely, if you ask me, I sincerely don't care why this man is not alive to defend himself. Secondly, he is not even alive for these people to get justice. So it keeps me. It's a mystery why all these things that are coming up keep coming up. You know, though one part of me is saying, uh -huh. there's also another you say, you cannot, you know, the truth cannot be covered forever. The truth, when it has been buried for a long time, it erupts like a volcano. But in the same sense, there's a mystery that says, you know, <sighs> person, we don't go, don't go. They are not going to get justice. It's not like this thing. But what level of satisfaction would this actually give to them? Look, could they share the look, they see where they speak. This thing will, you know, lead to. All right, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. So thank you for sending in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.